Next, we touch on one more topic, the final one, 08, on shaft. Shaft is an opening, okay, it's a shaft opening. Um, under certain circumstances, we use them, all right? You learn how to create floor plates already. When we talk about grouping, then you have to model a tower 50 stories high. What you do is, you draw the floor plates for the 50 stories and you copy them 50 times high. After that, however, though, you realize, hey, I forgot to include, oh dear, there is a lift here. There is an elevator here. I need to include the elevator opening. So what do you do? Okay, normally when you draw a floor plate this way, you draw the building up this way and then it forms up this, the floor plate for you. But because you forgot to include the, the elevator opening and then you have already copied the thing up 50 times because it's a 50 story tower, now you have to do it one by one by one by editing the boundary and adding in the floor opening like that to create the floor opening. Okay? this way it's done already except you have to duplicate it you have to con you have to do it again another 49 times because it's a 50 story building that's going to take you half a day just to do this okay not going to like it very much or you can spend two minutes now clicking on architecture clicking on shaft click on the shaft opening here it's like drawing another floor plate again. You will now take the walls of the, the elevator opening, okay? And clean up the lines if you have to, all right? And finish the job. It's done. This can potentially take care of 50 floors one shot. Huh? Now let me show you what happens when you open up by double clicking on the section here this way you look at the section right now okay if you mouse over this tap a little bit you can see this this looks like there's nothing there when you do not select it but when you mouse over it appears this is what we call the shaft or the elevator opening this part here now, it's useful, very useful, because if you select this and drag, uh, you see now here, you see the floor plates, right? The floor lines here happening. If you drag this down all the way, 50 floors, you now see that, look, the section now is a clear opening. You do not see the floor plates cutting into the elevator opening at all, the elevator shaft. <clears throat> All right. This is also very useful when you want to create a void in the space. Let's say especially above here where we are, that it is actually a void you want to create. You can do this instead of having to change the footprint of the floor or the roof. Okay? Or the floor in this case. It will cut right through things. Pretty useful command here. Easy and useful. Especially 50 floors, huh? doing it 50 times. Not very, uh, not something you want to be doing for, for the day. Okay, close this. 